Please. I want you to tell me. All my life, you're not doing shit. Stop playing, you're not doing shit. So what are you gonna do? What you gonna do? You see. You see. No, do it. Nigga, beat my ass. Beat my motherfucker. Go ahead, beat my ass right now. Go ahead. Listen. Go ahead, beat my ass. Ricky. I don't know what the fuck your problem is. You wanna break the other one? Go ahead, break the other one. You wanna do that? I don't know, I don't know what the fuck your problem is. But go ahead, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Good. Yep. You don't give a fuck? I'm not touching you. I'm not touching you. And then what? No, no. No, no. Ricky. Ricky. Beat my ass. I'm begging you to beat my ass. Go ahead, nigga. Beat my ass today. No, no, no. no. Beat my. You want to beat my. Ricky, I'm standing right here and I haven't moved. Beat my motherfucking ass in this house. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go. No, no, no. You want to fucking. No. Beat. I'm here. Don't tell me to come nowhere. Fuck out of here. You're not doing shit. Don't tell me to come. No. Don't tell me. No, nigga. Nigga, come beat my ass. Come beat my ass right now. Beat my motherfucking ass. I want you to. Listen. Come here. You I'm come here. You house. wanna you wanna beat my ass, nigga. You come here and beat my ass. You're that's all. That's all I ask you to do. That's no 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 no. That's all I ask you to do. Okay, what? Ricky, come, come beat my ass. Come beat my ass. No, nigga, come beat my ass. No no, come on. I'm begging. I'm begging you to beat my ass today. Come, come do it. Come do it. No, you're not leaving the house. No. Watch out. No. Watch the fuck. Nope. Up. Nope. Watch out. No. Beat my ass. Go ahead. No, no. Beat my ass. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. No, 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 no. I want you're you to touch me. I want you to touch me. All my life, you're not doing shit. Stop playing, you're not doing shit. So what are you going to do? What you going to do? You see. You see. No, do it. Nigga, beat my ass. Beat my motherfucker. Go ahead. Beat my ass right now. Go ahead. Listen. Go ahead. Beat my ass. I'm not Ricky. I don't know what the fuck your problem is. Man, when I first watched this video... It made me realize how important fathers are in a household, right? Because I remember so, not too long ago, right? I remember this very, very well, right? I was acting up at home. Now, being a son to an African mother is a whole different case, right? In Africa, parents whoop asses. Like, parents do discipline their kids. Like, I'm talking about the belt. I'm talking about whatever they can get their hands on if the kid acts out multiple times an african mother and african father is gonna discipline the kid right so i remember this one time i was coming I, I came from school and i think i don't know if my mother was telling me to take a shower or something but it's so it turns out uh i had issues at school already so my uh my teachers did call uh, my mom and they told her that I was acting up at school and I was fighting with her kids. Do you know one thing my mom did? My mom simply told me, I'm going to wait for your dad to come back from work. Oh my goodness. My dad whooped my ass, bro. My dad whooped my ass. Like, and that was the time I was like, okay, you know, like, and this is, this just shows exactly when there's no dad in the house, when there's no, uh, you know, uh, father figure when there's no masculine figure in the house you know and we all know these days like it's almost like 70 percent of households in america especially in the black community are led by single mothers right so and this is an issue that you can tell has been brewing like this boy didn't just wake up one morning and started acting up right 
this boy didn't just wake up one morning and started acting crazy this thing has been going on for so long but now because he's getting bigger and bigger you know we all know adolescent age like teenage age right boys tend to become like kind of strong big headed maybe they have issues at school also or maybe they have kids at school other friends who are influencing them so the mom didn't take care of this situation early on right that's why some single mothers who are smart what they do if the father isn't available they usually get their brothers or or the uncles of the kid to hang out with the kid and teach him a few things and this is really a big issue these days man like when the father is not in the house boys especially boys tend to you know they're gonna listen to the mom until they see that getting to the same height as the mom let's say in the middle school or at that uh maybe 13 15 15 16 age that's when the boys start acting out so i watched this video it really broke my heart because now the mom seems defenseless because all she can do is now get her phone and record the issues right yet i'm sure there have been red flags there have been signs this boy has been showing that he needs help right i would say the boy is in the wrong but he's not even an adult yet right this is just a teenage boy so he's been suffering and i'm sure he has been showing signs maybe one time the mom tells him to do this maybe his grades in school are suffering or maybe the teacher's keep calling the mom and like hey listen your son is not doing well or he's having issues at school but the mom maybe wasn't listening now it's really showing it's really coming out and the mom is being reactive instead of being proactive right so this boy everything that just happened the video you guys just watched this is going to be trauma for both of them the mom is now going to grow to be scared of the boy or maybe even give up on the boy but also the the boy is now always gonna even the little respect he had for the mom is now all gone because the mom showed that she's gonna engage him physically but also the boy realized now i can actually you know get in a physical altercation with my own mom so man i don't know what you guys think about this this video but i think this is a big issue in the black community uh whether in america whether in africa as long as there's no masculine figure there's no dad in the house and there's and the boy doesn't have that masculine presence to guide him whereby the mom if the boy does something bad the mom will be like hey listen i'm gonna let your dad know i'm gonna tell your uncle or something somebody who may whoop his ass and put him in line as long as that figure is not around boys tend to act up when they get to the adolescent or teenage teenage age especially once they start to grow tall and get to the mom's height they feel like the mom can't tell them nothing especially if the mom wasn't already already putting them in line when they were around nine or seven or eight or ten because that's when it starts you know some parents i think you know uh don't take care of the signs but that's when the signs start you tell the boy to do something the boy just barks at you or that pretends not to listen to you or you have to tell the boy multiple times to do something and he still doesn't do it so this is a very sad sad video i'm even i don't even know why the mom had to post it on social media because it doesn't make the situation better and this is going to be a traumatic experience for both of them in time to come what do you guys think leave your comments down below peace